Hello there, everyone. How you guys doing? Um, I am here with my precious, beautiful, awesome, Hello. anointed, powerful, <laughs> dynamic wife. Uh, we are so happy to be able to share with you guys. Uh, we wanted to do a video uh, to be able to encourage the single people. Just a little bit of the things that we have learned mm -hmm. in our process before we got married. We will be approaching uh, three years of marriage in two mm -hmm. weeks. Amazing. That has been good. <laughs> And many of you have saw the video that I did on keeping your relationship private. Um, I did a part one and a part two. So I may just put this as part three mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, about the importance of keeping your relationship private while you are getting to know someone. And and today we're, we're just going to share a little bit of to, uh, you know, just to encourage you guys on some things we did while we were dating to keep people out of our business. And we just prayed and, and, and did different things. So mm -hmm. we just want to share from that perspective. So, um, I know for me, uh, what I did, one of the things that I did, um, and that me and my wife, we decided to do when we first met was that we just going to let just some trusted people into our life mm -hmm. who knows about the fact that we are dating because my wife, she's, she was active at her church on the worship team doing other things. And he, me, I am, you know, associate pastor, min, uh, mm -hmm. minister. And, um, you know, so we need to be accountable as we're getting to learn about each other and everything like that. So we just pretty much told our family, uh, you know, we told our family, our pastors, Mm -hmm. And just maybe one or two trusted friends and everything else we kept private. Mm -hmm. All right. And that ties to the other videos that you guys have uh, seen on YouTube. If you haven't seen it, please go check out. Keep your relationship private. Uh, when I recorded that video, I did not know my wife. Wow. Uh, actually, I think I, I think I just met yeah, her. We know each other. Yeah, I think I just met her when I recorded that video. Mm -hmm. So uh, so we just wanted to share a couple of things that we did to um, that. Maybe if you want to take some tips um, as singles on if you met somebody. Um, so one of the things that um, and and um, my wife, you can share anytime you like. Uh, for me, one of the things um, that I did was um, in that process, because, you know, it's a temptation to want to tell everybody and start posting mm -hmm. on social media yeah. that you met somebody, yeah. you know. And so that was one of the things that we did that we just decided. We just said, you know what, we're just going to. Uh, be disciplined enough and wait. just wait. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so, <same. laughs> yeah. Yeah. It, you know, and it definitely for the, for the, for the, what would you say to the women out there who just have that urge just to show somebody that they are, that somebody, you know, that they're in a relationship and stuff? Yeah. For me, it's better to wait, girls, because, you know, until you really know and meet a person and you be sure that it's the, the, the person that God has for you. Uh, because you don't, you don't get like a quemarse, how we say it in Spanish, like a, with one person posting a picture and maybe it's not the right person, wow. you know. It's better to keep it private until you were sure. When you really, really be sure, post it. But trust me, it's better. Wow. It's better because it's, if not, you're going to be like a one relation now. And after a, another relation, is that not working? I'm going to be in another one. So it's better to wait until you be sure. Wow. Trust me, it's better. <laughs> it is. And I tell you, I thank God so much for having a person like my wife who had that mind because it made it easy. It kept a lot of yeah, frustration exactly. out of our relationship. Exactly. We were able to pray, focus on exactly. really getting to know each other as opposed to listening to, girl, I don't know if you should do it. Uh, dude, I don't yeah. know if you should do it. You want to keep all that foolishness. No. In a lot of in a lot of people maybe if you post it immediately, a lot of people is gonna be maybe oh you have a boyfriend and making like a lot of opinions, like different voices. You know how my husband said how we did. Say to the a specific person, for example, your pastors, uh, your parents, your family, but not immediately you're gonna bring it to your home to your family. You can just say like to pray and you know like a specific person that it really is important in your life. Uh, how I tell you, your pastor, maybe your parents. Uh, it doesn't have it to be immediately either. Like you're going to bring it to our family. So I know. Mm, that is excellent. Mm -hmm. So listen, guys, we're going to do another video soon on some other tips. Mm -hmm. But we just wanted to give you a little something just to let you know that, listen, um, in your waiting, yeah. don't get impatient. You know, enjoy, <laughs> enjoy the other person, but don't get so anxious to start posting things yeah, make sure please, it's right let please. people pray with you at the yes. process because you do not want to look like a, a schizo 
every two weeks posting up I'm exactly. in a relationship. This is, what I, this is what I was trying to say. <laughs> yeah, so so we hope that this was an encouragement to you guys. We're going to post up some more videos together. Mm-hmm. Uh, but this is my amazing blessing. She was worth the wait. And so we just yeah, wanted to encourage too. the single people, yes. let you know, listen, just keep trusting God. Yeah. But if you do meet somebody, don't get impatient to start posting you're in a relationship. Just get to know them. Let those few mm-hmm. trusted people pray mm-hmm. with you. Exactly. And then in our other video, we'll kind of share how long it took. Yeah. And some of the things that has encouraged us in the process. So we mm-hmm. hope that was a blessing to you. Uh, so uh, from me and my wife, we love you guys. And we will post some more <laughs> videos. All right. God bless you. You have a blessed Bye. day. Bye. <laughs>